Okay, this is worksheet 3.8, solving literal equations. You have to do 1 through 11 odd. So I'm going to work these out for you and make sure you know how to do it. So starting with number 1, it says solve for r. So we need to first identify where the r is. It's a little blurry. Okay, so our r is right here. I'm going to highlight it in yellow. So notice we have two terms. We have p and we have prt. The PRT is where our R is. So to get rid of this P, I'm going to subtract P from both sides. That gives me A minus P equals PRT because this is gone. It's zero. Now I'm solving for this R. So the operation between PRT is multiply. To undo multiply, I'm going to divide. I'm going to divide by P and by T. Over here, I have to do every single term by PT, not just the whole big thing, each term. So on the right, I'm left with R, which is what I was trying to solve for. Over here on the left, I have A over PT minus, now here's why we have to do each term separately. These P's cancel out. So on top, I'm left with an understood one and the T is left on bottom. So this right here would be my rewritten formula. A over PT minus 1 over T equals R. They wanted me to solve for R, I got R. Number three, solve for L. So this is the volume formula. Notice there's only one term, LWH. To solve for L, that first letter, I have to undo multiplication by dividing. And I'm going to divide by WH. So V over WH equals L. I solve for L. There's no reducing there. So I'm done. Number five, solve for M. Y equals MX plus B. So I'm going to find my M. It's right there next to the X. This time I have two terms, which means I'm going to have to use addition or subtraction. I'm going to undo add B by subtracting B from both sides. So Y minus B equals MX. Now I have to solve for this M, so I have to undo multiplying by dividing. So Y over X minus B over X equals M. I solve for M and I'm done. All right, number seven, solve for R. A equals 2RH, one term. So all I need to do is take care of the multiplying by dividing by 2 and H. So that leaves me with A over 2H equals R and I'm done. Number nine, solve for y. Ax minus by equals eight. Find that y, it's right there with the by. I have two terms. Now remember, there's an understood plus in front of the ax. So I'm actually going to subtract ax from both sides. So negative by equals eight minus ax. Now it doesn't matter if you put negative ax first or the eight, your choice. Then, we're going to divide by negative b. Now, here's where we have to be careful because of signs. y equals, well, that's just negative 8 over b. But a negative divided by a negative is a positive. So, ax over b, and I'm done. Be very careful of double negatives. All right, last one, number 11. P equals 2L plus 2W, it's our perimeter formula. We are solving for the L. Okay, be careful, it's not a 21, it's an L. So I'm going to start by subtracting 2W. There's two terms, you have to add or subtract one of them. P minus 2W equals 2L. I'm solving for W, so I have to divide every single term by 2. So P over 2 stays the same. This cancels, that's minus 1W, equals L. 
and I'm done. I solve for L, so that's it.